Hello and thanks for watching. In this video, you're going to see how to make rubrics viewable to your students before they begin an assignment and how they can see your feedback after they submit an assignment. I'm an English teacher and I'm in Power School Learning. Let's start with the basics. Up here under my avatar, my picture, you're going to see my rubrics. And just to make sure you have everything in place, the rubric you want to use has to be over here in your active tab. And here is my essay rubric down here. Now, previously, I've applied this rubric to my AP English assignment. Let me show you where that happened. This English essay right here, I was in the edit area. And underneath rubrics is where I assigned that. So I save that and I remind my students to click on the rubric because that's the part that's not easy to see. So from the student side, I'm going to switch over to Safari. That's where my student account is. And I have this English essay. I click on that assignment. And my teacher has reminded me, click on the rubric right up there. It's not distinguished in any way. It's the same color. But once I click on that, the rubric is visible. And I can see what categories that I'm being graded on at this point. OK, I've handed in an assignment. I've turned in a Word document. And my teacher has already looked at that. Let's go see what that looks like from the teacher's perspective to grade those. I'm switching back to my teacher page, and I want to view the work that's been handed in. So I click on my student over here. I open their submission in the annotator, and I've made my comments, I made my remarks, my annotations, and I'm going to pull up the grade button right here. That's where I find the rubric. I have to click on the rubric over here, and now I can click those categories and also leave comments in those categories. Wow, this is very concisely worded. And this button here would let you sync it to the gradebook, and you say done. There's one final thing that needs to be done from the teacher side, and it's very well concealed. Make this visible to students. You have to go into your grade books, and once you're there, you have to find the assignment. So the essay assignment is right here. There's three little dots. You have to click those, and you have to publish the rubric. Mine currently is published, so that's why it lets me choose unpublish. Let's go back to the student side one last time. And as a student, I've already handed this in. And now I see this feedback right here that lets me see these boxes are checked here and here. And all of my feedback is found right over here. Thanks for watching. Hope this helped.